And he is 6'2", 195. LeBlanc with a dark brown glove ready. He's going to work out of the stretch, and he delivers. First pitch of the night is outside ball one, and we are underway. 6.36 Central Time. We are underway. Wheels up on an 80-degree Wednesday night. Here's a drive down the right field line. Long run, Peterson in the corner, back toward the wall. That ball is off the wall. Is it gone? It's gone for a home run. Tom Hanneman on the call. It's a home run for Drew Waters. It is windy tonight, and I mentioned it in the open. At times, it is a cross breeze over toward that right field corner, and Drew Waters just got that out. He homered twice last night for the first time in his professional career, and the very highly touted young Braves prospect leads off the game with a home run to the right field corner. In the top of the third, it's Way LeBlanc against Drew Waters. Lefty on righty and the pitch. Waters lines one to left, a base hit. Boy, this kid is having some kind of series so far. Two homers last night, his first career. Make this summer the best one yet with a membership to the Y. Zero entry pools, water slides, and splash pads offer fun for the whole family. Join by May 17th and pay nothing until June. Visit trythewide.com today. Green is near the bag at third. The pitch to Waters is fisted foul off to the right out of play. He jammed him at 88. Waters with a home run leading off the game and singled and scored in the third. Switch hitting 22-year-old Braves prospect and one of the top 50 prospects in the game, according to MLB.com. Second round pick by Atlanta in 17, and he's an Atlanta native. Here's the 0-1. Waters takes outside, one ball and one strike. Drew Waters had a very impressive 2019 season. Here's the 1-1, and it's taken down low for a ball. He did not play last year. He was at the Braves' alternate site. But in 2019, he won the Southern League batting title and MVP award. Batted 319 in 108 games. The 2-1 pitch, reached for, bounce toward the middle, and that's going to get through into center field for a base hit. Waters, a big turn. He's going to second. The throw there by Ray is offline. And Drew Waters now adds a hustle double to the mix tonight. He saw that all the way. It got between Robertson and Strange Gordon into kind of shallow left center. Corey Ray raced after it but could do nothing with the speed of Waters. MVP, only one guy did it multiple times. Here's the pitch, and it's bounced on the ground left side, and the hold it short, Robertson. Off balance throw, good throw, and he gets Drew Waters. Finally, Waters makes it out. Nice play by Robertson, one gone in the end. The infield can back up now. Waters, a switch hitter batting from the right. He's got three hits tonight, triple shy of the cycle. The pitch by Andrews, and Waters gets jammed and fists one foul off to the right out of play. <laughs> by the way, Corey Kluber has just thrown a no-hitter. The Indians... Right-hander against his old club, the Rangers. The 0-1, inside for a ball. Corey Kluber has completed a no-hitter and two nights in a row now. There's been a no-hitter in the big leagues. Six of them now this season. The Yankees beating Texas in Texas. Here's the 1-1 now, and Waters takes it for a strike at the letters. Outside edge. Two outs, runner at third, a run in, 3-2 Gwinnett.
Here's the stretch. And the pitch by Andrews. Check swing. Did he go? He did not on the appeal. Tom Hanahan's been busy down there at first tonight, umpiring on a lot of appeal calls. Luke Maley talking with plate umpire Rich Grassa now. And Maley is hot. Rick Sweet is coming out now as the plate umpire was talking with Maley. Sweet wanted to make sure Luke didn't get himself run. Yeah, the sounds a few times tonight have thought they've gotten a strike on a committed swing only to see the appeal go the other way. Two balls, two strikes on Drew Waters. Goins, the man at third after the RBI triple. Top of the 10th, Gwinnett by a run. Andrews ready, third base side of the rubber and the 2-2 pitch. And it is just a little bit low, and Andrews is fired up, and Clayton better be careful. He is shouting after not getting that call, and that looked like it was right at the bottom of the zone. Rick Sweet is coming out, and he is hot. Two different times, the Sounds thought they had strike three on Drew Waters. And the sounds manager, Rick Sweet, heading back to the dugout, just shy of getting ejected. It was close. Rich Grasso, you could tell, was about ready to run him. Three and two the count on Drew Waters. A swing, and then it looked like a called third strike that was right there in the zone. Now the payoff again, and Waters fly, live, flies one out to right center. That's going to drop for a base hit, and the Stripers get a run out of it. And Clayton Andrews is hot again. Drew Waters singles to right center. Goins scores. Luke Maley is again talking with the plate umpire. It is 4-2 Gwinnett. Maley's been ejected. Luke Maley, the Sounds catcher, is fired up with Rich Grassa right in the face of the plate umpire. He's been tossed from the game. The Sounds thought they had Drew Waters struck out twice and neither time got the call. I feel like the, the lack of the call third strike was more egregious looking based on the monitor than the check swing, but both certainly have drawn the ire of the sounds who now need a new catcher mario feliciano will be coming in sounds have already used christian kelly as a pinch hitter rick sweet still talking with the plate umpire rich grassa gwinnett has taken a two-run lead rick sweet still out there in the face of the plate umpire the crew chief, Charlie Ramos, came down from third. He's involved, trying to cool the temperatures here. Sounds have their bullpen starting to loosen now. Rick Sweet is pointing at Rich Grassa, and now Rick Sweet's been tossed. Man. There was a check swing on Waters. And there have been several check swings tonight. The Sounds thought should have gone the other way. And then after the check swing, Clayton Andrews threw a pitch that looked like it was right in the zone. Clayton Andrews jumped up and down in shock.